is Honest Mike. You're watching Scoot TV show version 5. And on this week's show, we're gonna, we've got... Don't you have a lot of moped footage to show? Wait, yeah, I do. I guess uh, this is gonna be the show. On today's show, we've got this dude who found a treasure chest of old derby moped parts. In fact, he donated some parts to the show, and we're going to figure out how we're going to raffle them up. Also have some desert racing footage. Ooh, yeah, we got some secret underground footage of uh, something that was dropped off at the Tomahawk shop. It was pretty intense. It's all under a briefcase, lock and key. Shh, I said too much. Take one. Hi, I'm Matt, and you're watching Scoot TV, Moped Division. Yep. Coming down to go see Matt Knucklehead. Get to see some old school imported derby parts from Catalina. I tracked down the original owner of the derby dealership and uh, Shut up. his son gave me like a bunch of just random addresses to like boats. Yeah. And I literally go to these people's boats and talk to them like, hey, I'm looking for derby stuff. Do you have any of it? Can I buy it? Can I look at it? I mean, maybe you're not comfortable with parting yeah. Yeah, yeah. with it yet, but here's my number. And uh, I got a couple calls back and I went over there and I just picked everything up as I could, as much as I could that one day. I, I saw that post. I saw threw that it, post. Threw it on the barge. I mean, Oh, it, was, it was crazy. There was like somebody had taken a, a trailer and then dug it in the side of a hill out there and put dirt over it and I had to like, climb into this thing for derby parts. For derby parts and it's like collapsed at the very end because it's all rusted to fuck. Buried treasure derby parts? Found you know? a bunch of stuff in a crawl space under this lady's house. That's where I found this pipe on the, on the derby. Oh my god. And I found this Laguna Damn. tail. That's pretty rare. Super rare. An RD50, uh... Yeah, I saw that post, and I was just gonna joke him. I'll pick up some... some derby parts. Yeah, I know you're gonna get the holy grail. I haven't ran it in the last couple of days, so we'll probably start. Probably needs another car You got this with the factory. All these guys were pretty messed up, but I cleaned them all up with uh, vinegar. This is a flat reed? Yeah, never flat used? Flat reed never used. Jeez Louise, this uh, is so... And they got their branding everywhere. Yeah, this is derby. Everywhere. Put it on and everything. Then here's... Yeah. This one was also never used, but it's just kind so of... Comparison, comparison side by side. How many other chances in my life I'm going to be able to do yeah. that? <laughs> is that one never used too? That yeah, dirt? this one was never used. Oh, dude, it's beautiful. They put metal reeds in this one. They used carbon reeds in that Carbon fiber. And that was back in the 80s, so that was expensive as fuck to make. Beautiful. What's cool about the flat reeds is they have a 19 mil intake that you can just slap onto this and throw a 19 PVNG and still use your existing reed setup. Damn. They sit like that. Key start. That is hilarious. And it just in. Uh, do they have branding on that too? Um, it doesn't say it on the outside, but it says it on the inside. Yeah. 13 tooth instead of a 20. Damn. <laughs> and they all say derby on them. Derby. Or if it doesn't say derby, they'll say Rob. Name. Yeah, 20s, 19s. That'd be better for hill, hill action. Yep, yep. Alright, so let's go look for... Beautiful. I'm gonna get 19. Right there's a 20. I'm gonna go look at mine, see what I've got right now. What else? He's got everything. That derby. Paddles. Gold mine. 
Yeah, in the 70s when Derby was considering being the first dealership on Catalina Island, uh, the city as a leap of faith and an incentive to put bikes on the island put into the city stature that you could ride the bike from one side of the island to the other. And it's literally the only vehicle on the island that you're allowed to go from Avalon to Twin Harbors to all the way back into the boonies. And I mean, it's 70 square miles of mopedding heaven. Damn! We do gotta do a ride yeah, out there. it's a lot of fun. They have all these trails. Bikes aren't even allowed on that you're allowed to take the mopeds on. Awesome little... Derby facts. Yeah, and they haven't they haven't redacted the uh the You wanna show your bike? Sure, yeah. When we start filming, what, how do we want to do it? We come up with the terms live. What are you donating for I'm, a raffle? I'm donating some stock derby piston rings. Right on, brother. We're going to raffle off some of these things. Fellow pet heads, a nice donation for Matt Knucklehead. Thanks, brother. Yeah. All right. Make sure they get to someone who needs them. Yep. got back from picking up derby stuff and uh, piston. We'll see how much stuff I have in my backpack. That's it. All the stuff I carried with me. Honest. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Riding down scooters out to the desert for So it's four in the morning, right before the moped race out in the desert. Hey dude, how's it going? Are you going to sleep or getting up? Um neither. <laughs> Moped desert racing, we're way off schedule by about two hours. 12 o'clock, supposed to be hot out in the desert. Had some mechanical problems. Uh, busted the gear oil. Busted? Not, you yeah, didn't bust it, you stripped it. I stripped the bolt. Damn it. Here it is, folks. The make or break gear uh, oil drain bolt from a Honda Elite 150. No, it's not me. Careful, she might jump up. Oh man. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> weld nut. A weld nut, man. So right there's our emergency bolts. We marked it off, see if it backs off. Hey, where are we at, brother? Chris line. Where are we supposed to be at? The uh, desert, and we're up at Big Bear. Yeah. Awesome. We're we'll at Apple Valley. This is Honest Mike from Scoot TV, and we're lost. <laughs> And we're happy because our bikes are still running. What's up, brother? <laughs> Scoot TV. Scoot TV. We rode streets all the way out That's here. That's what man. they were saying. Oh, that ain't shit, man, on the track. Dude, where'd you come from? L.A., man. Came from L.A.? L.A. My name's Omar. I'm from Victorville, and you're watching Scoot TV. Moped Division. Woo!
this race to, man. So you know it's all about second bake. It's all about the start, though. You know that now. Yeah. So what do you got on it? Stock, stock engine? Stock. And a pipe. Modified bike turbo? Yeah. Alright, let's get ready. Alright, let's get the tools ready then. Slow class race, that's us. Nice. You know, let me see this thing. It's got this. Okay, here we go. Tim Ross, number 88, with a good lead. Battling it out for second. White suit. That's you, fucked up. Oh man. I slid good too. It was fucking, I was coming around the corner and there, and there was a crack. Yeah? And it, I was like leaning over and it hit the crack and it was all, oh shit, washed out. Oh, I missed it. it On that go ready? Yeah, right there. You just did it? You just yeah. did it? Yeah. Oh, nice. Is it running? The channel? Yeah. I just took it around the track. It oh. handles pretty, pretty deep. So, what do you have? Like? Melossi case. Melossi, the big one? Yeah. Melossi case, Panasco cylinder. 75 cc? 75 cc. Okay. Because the one I've, I've seen before, they, they come out. Oh, the side ones. The yeah, side that one's retarded. Like you buy half the case, put the other half on your stock case. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Take a look. Primo stuff. Some, some French stuff what, right here, man. Need, the hard stuff. Do I need sunglasses? Because you got sunglasses. Oh my god. Dude, I got stuff I don't even know what it's for. It came with in a briefcase? Oh, I put it in a briefcase. Okay. <laughs> it's part of the... I know. <laughs> Take two! Three. Motor stand. Look at this stuff. This stuff is... Ooh, that's <laughs> some good stuff. Gold. What is that shit? I don't know. I don't even know what that stuff is. Stuff's imported, man. Oh, this is for the bearings. 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 Oh, drivers. Yeah. Yeah, you have the. Yeah. Oh, there's a mallet. Wow. This is factory stuff. This is the stuff you see in the manual. The door, Cops coming. You should close the door, yeah. Let the dog look. Record his ass. No, don't even yeah, uh, Take a little break. I need a break. No, we're not going to break. Okay. <laughs> Let's keep rolling. 1978, dude. March 1978. Gas tank seal. I think this is the Peugeot blood. Oh, the, the famous Peugeot blood? Shh, watch it, man. Are you recording the Peugeot? I think somebody's yeah, Here it is, man. Peugeot blood. The cops are coming. I hear the cops. Oh, shit. I gotta go. Produit d'obturation. What is it? For use with glass pipe only. <laughs> <laughs> we just made this innocent movie into the most corrupt. <laughs>